hey, uh, when you see this, happy birthday. D has been, to this point, at least two months since the first time we met. And we just, we sort of clicked instantly. We've been best friends ever since. We would always talk to each other, we'd always uh, know how to make each other laugh, know how to make each other smile, uh, and just know how to have a good time. I understand that we've had our ups and we've had our downs literally within like freaking two months. It's a freaking roller coaster. But I would be lying to you if I told you I still didn't have fun while still knowing that I can come to you no matter what happened. So, I want to say happy birthday. Uh, let's, let me share, let's, let's share a little story. Uh, I think we met on the 22nd of December. So, first of all, the fact that time flew by way too quickly for this to happen. I remember we were still talking about like when your birthday was in January and oh boy. Oh boy. Man, I remember that like it was yesterday. I remember uh, what I wanted to do. And then, you know, let me just let you know right now, sometimes things don't work out the way that they should. So I had to pull some strings. So I hope you enjoy this. Uh, I just decided to really just sit down and just be completely real with you, you know, because that's what you deserve. On your birthday, if you expect anyone to be real with you, it should be your best friend. So, I love you. You are an amazing best friend. You always know how to make me laugh, how to make me smile. You always are just, you're ready to go, basically. Whenever I need you, you're, you're willing to drop anyone, you know. And you have done it before. And I know that you would continue to do it. Now, I'm going to tell you to stop it, but I know you will. I know that in the end, that's what makes you a great best friend. Not only are you caring towards me, but you love everyone. You have touched the lives of not only myself, you have touched the lives of Steph, Joe, Malika, Sam, Charlie. Practically anyone you come in contact with, you have made their lives better in some way and honestly I don't think we could ask for anything anymore uh, so I know I said I was going to tell you a story and then I sort of leaned off so let's, let's, let's head back it's still hard to believe that we've known each other for over two months um, and again we became best friends instantly um, I want to share with you the time that I know you had felt a certain way. And all you did when you texted me telling me you wanted me to talk, and it just calmed me down. So, if I was able to do that for you, I would continue to do that for you. And because you have this now, you can use this video as well to continue that, you know? If I'm not around for some reason, and you need it, then you use this video for me. Alright? Don't forget that this is here. Um, honestly, in the end, I just, I really can't thank you enough for everything that you've done. You are honest. You are amazing. You're sweet. Kind. And you know how to put a smile on everyone's face. I mean, I could probably say this over and over and over again. Uh, but you just, you just, you, you know how to bring a party. How many times have I watched you go live and all of a sudden, literally everyone is there. Literally within a matter of seconds, everyone's there. You know why? Because you caused that. You made it so that way they felt comfortable coming to you whenever they needed to. You made it so it was easy to join your stream. 
And I think that's what I felt when I joined. Because I did tell you, and I'm going to say it again, I was going to leave. I wasn't going to stay in the stream for as long as I was. I was going to leave. But for some reason, I stayed. Now that I think, now that I think about it, if I had left, I probably would have made the biggest mistake of my life. Uh, but right off the bat, we guessed it. So I, I asked to guess. You put me on screen, and still not knowing who the hell I was. You did not know shit, <laughs> and you still bought me on. So. And instantly, we disconnect. We went from that. Uh, so, I've seen literally almost, not even almost everything, we've only like two fucking months. Calm down. Um, but I've seen a lot within the time that we have been friends for. Uh, and honestly, I want to say right here, right now, that I do want to continue this friendship going forward for a very, very long time. For years to come, as I'm recording this, your birthday is literally two days away. Um, and honestly, it's still, you're gonna be 19. I had to think about that real quick. You're gonna be 19. You're gonna be the same age as me for about a couple months and I turn um, I mean, Everything you heard, I meant it. I meant it to Not only did I mean it, but I have seen it. This is not just me flattering you. Although I would do that. Uh, this is me telling you this. Telling you from my perspective of what I have seen. And honestly, everyone loves it. Before I go, I'm going to leave you with this message. Don't ever try to bring yourself back. Because everyone does love you. And if you just take the time to look and to see it, you're going to look, you're going to see it, you're going to be happy. You're going to be happier. What else can you say? Whatever you decide to do, we'll be able to love you later. We want it to be a little bit of a Whatever it is, enjoy your day. Make it count. Because you won't see it again from 365. So, before I leave, I'm going to say thank you for everything. Happy birthday, Jim. I hope you have an amazing day and an amazing time. I'm sorry that I can't have you spend your time. I'll be there soon. I'm out the door. It's like it's gone away.